Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Kyle. I'd like to welcome you to Bearded, Brood, and Tattooed. If you're new here, please feel free to uh, share, like, subscribe. I'm brand new here in the YouTube world and just trying to get my channel out there. So yeah, thanks for joining me today, guys, and I really appreciate you taking the time. Today, kids, we're going to be talking about the one and only Black Rebel. That's right. Sporting them hard today, guys. Got my coffee mug for Black Rebel as well. All right, let's dive into this one today, shall we? Awesome. All right, so first up, we're going to be talking about Hendrix. Hendrix is known as their voodoo cologne. They do a lot of cologne type scents. All different though, like just different varieties and different styles. Ugh. But nonetheless, every cologne scent is a little different from each other, but still just absolutely killer. And I like the fact that this company highlights a lot of music type uh characters a lot of music icons and whatnot hendrix being one of them i'll tell you right now guys if i had the ability to travel back in time i would absolutely go to the original woodstock that would be the one place and the one time in history i would love to travel back to and just watch hendrix just riff on the guitar that would just absolutely make my year I think that would be so cool to go and watch. So yeah, I have this in not only the oil, but I also have it in the butter. Let me show you guys the consistency of this. So smooth and thick, you guys. You just drag your finger right across in there. Comes out super, super well. I absolutely love this stuff, guys. I would use this almost daily if I could, but I've got a ton of other products that I use as well. Yeah, their consistency, their quality, awesome guys. Definitely go check these guys out. Definitely worth your time. They are out of El Paso, Texas. Guy named Pedro runs the show down there. And let me tell you guys, Pedro and his crew, awesome. I've had to, you know, send a few things back here and there, but uh, they always come up big for me. And they always stay true to their word. They always make sure that I'm happy. I, I can't speak highly enough of them. So, all right, we're going to move on. Bronco Buster. So, again, another cologne scent. A smoky cowboy cologne is what they dubbed this one as. Again, super crisp, super fresh. Manly, very masculine, but yet very subtle at the same point in time. I will say this company, though, uh, their scent lasts a really long time, which personally I actually like. I know a lot of you guys out there don't really like a whole lot of scents that last, you know, eight, ten hours. Literally, though, I can go to work and do an eight, ten hour shift, and I still smell this when I get home. Everyone that I'm around at work is just like, wow, that smells really good. You know, I dig everything about this company. I've went out and I've purchased quite a few different scents from these guys. Again, I've not only got the oil, but I've got the butter. I personally don't like wearing uh, an oil that doesn't match with the butter that I'm going to put on for that day. I like to, you know, wear one with the other. That's just my own personal preference. I don't really like to use another company's oil and then another company's butter. I, I'm not a guy that likes to mix and match. Feel free to do that if you want. I mean, go for it. Hey, you know, rock what you do. But uh, personally, just not my gig. All right. We're going to move on. Cruiser. I really like this. It is known as a sandalwood vanilla. Oh, God, what was the other one? I can't even think of it. But, yeah, sandalwood and vanilla were the only two that I really got from this. Oh, lavender. That was the other one that was said to be in here. Lavender, sandalwood, and vanilla. Three cents I love. I 
I really like this stuff. I haven't used it a whole lot. I mean, I've been using a lot of their other products here. Again, I do have the butter. Haven't used this one yet, as you can tell. So I'm fresh up on that one. Definitely got to start digging into that one more often. One of my favorites, moving on from that one, I've talked about this one in my last video, Cash. Personally, I love Johnny Cash. I grew up on Johnny Cash. I grew up on Merle Haggard, Patsy Cline, all the old classics, Willie Nelson. I, I grew up on that kind of music. And so when I saw that they had a Cash uh, created character, you know, as far as their sense, this is a whiskey barber shop. I love this and I use it quite often, as you guys can tell. I've definitely used it a lot. It's probably one of my favorites on their scented lineups. Again, butter-wise, just so, so, you know, easy to come out. And it emulsifies down so quickly, you guys. Quality is top-notch. This is definitely a company that I would highly recommend. Absolutely worth your guys' time. Check them out. Give them a try. We're going to move right on. All right. The Nomad. When I saw this, I absolutely love anything having to do with motorcycles. I don't have one personally. Would love to ride one, but I'm short and that's just a nightmare for anyone to try to figure that one out. But yeah, so this was an incense and oudsen. Uh, it's just, it's so different. I definitely get the incense out of that. It's just a different scent than I've usually, you know, seen from anybody else. Incense is not really a thing that a whole lot of beard companies dive into. There's a few here and there. God, I love this. Awesome stuff. Again, quality top notch, you guys. Awesome, awesome stuff. All right. So, another one of my favorites from these guys. Yippee ki motherfucker. So, this stuff is cool. I absolutely love the scent of this. So, let me get out of here for a little quick. It's kind of funny, when I purchased this, it was known as an aqua cologne, and I was like, interesting, but I definitely want to give it a try. Die Hard is absolutely one of my favorite movies of all time, and if you guys don't think that Die Hard isn't a Christmas movie, I hate to break it to you, yeah, it definitely is. At least in my own opinion, it is not Christmas time until I see Hans Gruber getting thrown off the Nakatomi Plaza. It's just my own thing. So again, scent, awesome, quality, just amazing, you guys. Absolutely love this place. Moving on to the Wildcat Sporty Leather Cologne. I'm not a huge leather fan as far as the scent of it goes. But you definitely get, like, a more masculine cologne. I really love the scent of this. Didn't think I was really going to because, again, I'm not a huge, like, leather-scented fan. But, you know, I know a lot of you guys are. A lot of you guys like to get, you know, leather wallets and whatever else. So, if that's for you, sure. let me tell you, you're going to dig this one. Again, I have not used this butter haven't really used this one a whole lot, but I'm definitely going to start having to dig more into this one as well. All right, moving on. So this was one of their limited editions called Sparrow. Again, I love anything having to do with pirates. I was a huge Pirates of the Caribbean fan, Johnny Depp fan. Shout out to Johnny Depp. All right, so this is basically their... Bay Rum uh, scented profile. And you totally get that out of this. Love this stuff. I think it's really, really badass. Sparrow, it was one of their limited editions. What I love about this company, and I don't see a whole lot of other companies doing this, but Black Rebel 
puts out a lot of limited edition scents. I think they do it like maybe once or twice every month or two. Um, and I don't see a whole lot of other companies, you know, doing that. And to me, that's pretty awesome. And I know that as soon as they put, you know, this scent out or one of their limited edition scents out, that it's gone within a day or two. It, it, it literally does not last on their shelves. So kudos to them. I think that's an awesome way to do business. And so my hat is off to Pedro and the boys and whoever else is working there for him. So way to go, guys. All right. We have one more left. Last but not least, the wild one. This is a tobacco vanilla. And so I really like this. I usually don't. I usually don't like tobacco scented products. I'm not a smoker, never have been, and never will be. But let me tell you, this is pretty great. You definitely get like that masculine, like cigar, but yet not overwhelmingly. You know, it, it really is a great scent. And so if that's for you guys, for sure, definitely go and grab you some of that. You can definitely get it, you know, on their lineup. Again, the butter, just awesome, you guys. Love it. Right on. So that's my uh, Black Rebel lineup, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video today. Let me know if you guys use Black Rebel. Reach out. Please interact. I, I'm waiting to, you know hear from you guys in the comments. I would love to get your guys' feedback. Let me know if you guys have had really great experiences with Black Rebel. Would love to hear what you guys are using, you know. Let's interact. Let's kind of have some fun here, guys. All right. Until next time, I will see y'all in the next video.